I didn't even know she was Jewish. I just wore the yarmulke because I thought it would be fun, you know? Oh, good morning, everyone. Let me tell you a little bit about what Fratastic Encompass is, okay? It's three things, food, booze, and titties. If you could eat leftovers at a strip joint while pounding a six pack of Beast Ice, you'd still be roughly 100 bottles of beer on the wall away from what is to be known here as Fratastic. Let me be your guide, your guru, if you will, as we journey to the heart of what is known as Fratastic. Down it. So we're here with Scott now. Uh, hi. Scott, what do you have in your refrigerator at home right now? You live with a woman? I do live with a woman. So what do you have in your refrigerator? Uh, we have eggs. All right, let's take a look at what we're working with here. Okay. Um. Mind if I grab a beer? Probably some vodka and cheap beer. Nice. Yeah. Cheese. You want to explain this? Um, Don't even. You know what? It, it smells no, like the inside of a gay man's ass. I want it out of my sight. Go put it with your silk shirts. Cream cheese. Um, yeah, hey, what's up? Jam. It's for after work. It's after work? Where do you work? At a dick sucking club? Get this the fuck out of here. It's not funny. Get it out of here. A bottle of wine. Uh, two blue moon. Uh, let's see. Did you take inventory this morning? Some yeah, no, fish, I know it's, it's small beans, but uh, it, it should last me through the uh, weekend. Problem number one: three beers, not gonna be enough. I, look at you, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> I mean, I know that Target has great value on clothing, but the shirt. Really, Little Caesars Pizza, huh? Yeah. So you, you have any dignity? Oh, What's a whisk? A whisk is a. You know what a whisk is? Yeah, you make a. No. Over here. No. When you were working on Spinal Tap. What was the uh, the kind of food that the catering brought in? It's slim pickings here, John, but I think I can help you. I mean, I mean, Tom, actually, so it doesn't matter. Be honest. After a night, a little bit of drinking, has he ever peed the bed with you in it? Oh. Is she? <laughs> no. No. That sounded like a confession to me. Soy sauce. If you don't have soy sauce, teriyaki sauce, barbecue sauce, be creative. Don't bother me with this shit. Just pick something. When's the last time you shit your pants? Uh, Boner. John is boiling the ramen noodles Tom, and some beef. And some beer. Always boil ramen noodles in beer. Gives it a little bit of extra tang, a little bit of extra zest. Who do you think is uh, is more well endowed, Peter O'Toole or Martin Landau? I'm gonna go with Peter O'Toole. Peter O'Toole, correct. <laughs> Would you ever make meatloaf for a lady? Like if you had a lady friend come over? Meatloaf is that in poor taste? I don't think so. I, I, you make meatloaf Maybe, uh, for my guy. I swear to God, if you correct me on the name thing again, I'm gonna fucking put your head name, through that bro. microwave. My name's... Me? What would you make your girlfriend, like if you had to tell her that uh, you had had intercourse with another woman, and you had to cook her dinner the night you were gonna tell her, what would you make? Spaghetti. It's messy. Spaghetti. Yeah, and the whole conversation's gonna be messy after that one. And of course, beer. The ubiquitous ingredient in any fantastic meal. So John and I are gonna get cooking on this. I am not kidding. Get a, get a pan out of the bottom, down there. Okay. We're gonna get cooking, you guys take a look at this. Germ, germ, everywhere a germ, germ. Old MacDonald had a farm. 